Okay. Well, we have an update on Sheree Whitfield's love life. Sheree confirmed that she is indeed dating Martel Holt and that she has already introduced him to her friends. The pair were also captured in a video provided by TMZ showing some public display of affection. Are y'all rooting for this couple? Q, I know you made a, a, a video of it. So of this story, what do you think? So here is what's interesting. I spoke to one of my colleagues in media who has a very close relationship with Martel Holt. And according to her, Martel Holt is pissed and said that he and Sheree are not together, said that Sheree is not even his type, that he is building a pool for Sheree and is working closely with her pulling permits and so on and so forth, that he is not with her and that his phone was ringing off the hook all day that day and that he is extremely upset that she said that so i don't know what the truth is at this point because on the flip side of things charade has never struck me as the type of woman who would go around claiming a man that's not claiming her and i don't know how in any way shape or form she's incentivized or rewarded for attaching a body to her but according to our media colleague that knows Martel, he's extremely upset and said that she's not his type and that they they are not together. Didn't we see video of them looking pretty? Yeah, that don't look like he doing no pool with the video that we I, just showed. I completely it's agree. Awesome. I'm just telling you what the people said. Also, wow. Claudia, I'm gonna give a shout out to Freddie O because Freddie O just conducted an interview with her. He caught up with her, and in the interview, he asked her point blank, "Hey, what's going on with you?" And Martell, and she shared the skin and she said that, you know, that they are hanging out, that they're spending time and that they were introduced through mutual friends. Now, I've known Sheree to do a lot of things, but I don't think she has to lie about this one to the point where he's disgusted. That's kind of weird. I I agree. Um, now, I don't know Martell, but from the little stuff that I hear about the show, he doesn't, he seems like he is not born to maybe telling a lie or two. Right. Uh, he's, well, got other, he's, got, he's got other women. <laughs> he's got a whole nother woman. He has other pregnant. women that he's, you know, trying to keep happy and, and don't want to make them mad. Of course, it would be a, a negative. Like, uh, guys don't like being put on blast when they ain't all the way cleared out to all the other girls that they're messing with. Mm -hmm. And he has other people he's still answering to. Because I, I too, I second that out. Sheree is not a liar. Not as far as right. I know. I She don't need a lot of kick it. She's been in media in the, t in the industry long enough. Long enough. She knows that, that would backfire in her face if she lied about a dude like that. And doing um, interviews. The only thing that only the thing that's a little bit weird for me here is that I, I've been to Sheree's house. I don't know if you guys have been to her house on the inside of that house. That inside of that house is like a castle. It's beautiful. Furniture, expensive. Everything in there costs a million dollars. I just don't see her dating a man that's got five kids and then five kids coming and running through Chateau Charest. <laughs> I just don't see that. I don't see that part at all. That's the only thing that's a little bit awkward here in this story. And Charest, if you are dealing with him, which I do believe you are, and he has the audacity to tell people that, that, that you know, he deny you, please run from him because you deserve a man that will proudly claim you. You don't need Absolutely. all that nonsense. He's, he's, he said it, Charest, and if you want to know who he told it to, Get my phone number from Cynthia Bailey and call me. I'm going to text her after the show. I, she I can get it from me. I tell, or, or, or call Al and I'll tell you exactly who we told it to. Okay, we're going to connect y'all two after the show.